happy Mother's Day week, you guys. I hope you had a great weekend and treated your mamas right. Got a lot of great stuff in today's video for you. You're gonna wanna stick around. We have a challenge that you can do right here now. Just finished it with my mama here in the backyard and she crushed it, man. Also have a great recipe to share with you and then I'm gonna show you my hit cardio this is actually one I've been using as a replacement for stairs booty cardio which is one of my workouts in my build a butt extreme program and so if you don't have access to a stairs like since we moved I'm not going to San Diego stairs anymore but you definitely have ways to still get it done. You can do it on a step mill at the gym or you can do like what I'm gonna show you here. Before we get into the cardio, I want you to do this five minute plank challenge with us. So get down on your forearms right now and the clock is starting. You're gonna hold this plank for five minutes. You can change to different variations of the plank, but you cannot relax or let your knees touch the ground at all. Stay in a plank for the entire five minutes. Keep watching as you're planking to see if you can beat Brad or me or my mom. Who's gonna last the longest? Let's go.
love that you get to change position. into how I do stairs booty cardio without a stairs. You don't have to have a stairs to do this. It's just all about elevating your heart rate and getting a good interval style workout, whether you have stairs or not. So this is one of the alternatives I use. It's, I, I just call it hill sprints. Wow, it is windy. Yeah. <laughs> it was too windy to chat. So let's just get into these hill sprints. Here I'm doing the two minute warm up from the workout. So just jogging at a low intensity for two minutes. Now in the workout, I recommend using a staircase that's at least 20 steps. If you don't have a staircase, then I recommend doing a hill sprint that is at least 20 seconds long. So instead of counting the steps here, I just count the time. So you kind of measure a distance that takes you about 20 seconds when you go all out at high intensity and you consider that your space to do these intervals. So I'll walk down to the bottom of my hill and this is not a very steep hill, it's just kind of a slight incline. So I go a little bit further away than I would if it was a steeper hill. And then once I get to the bottom of that hill, I set myself up in a ready position and I take off as fast as I can, really pushing myself and sprinting at my all out max intensity. So once I reach the finish line, I stop and then I do these stairs jump downs. So just using the curb of the street. So I'll stand up on the top of the curb and then jump down and land in a squat, really engaging my glutes. So I go back and forth between these, just like the workout says, and I follow the number of intervals based on the phase that I'm in. So pretty simple, very effective, great workout. Never takes me longer than 20 minutes, usually somewhere between 10 and 20 minutes and then I'm back home and it's so simple. You gotta get your cardio done if you want a nice lean, tight, firm booty and doing it short and quick like this really makes it so doable. So I hope you enjoyed seeing this. Just finished Sears Booty Cardio from Build It By Extreme. This is a little variation on it. Obviously I didn't use the stairs, but you don't have to use the stairs. It's all about your heart rate and just elevating it to that high intensity level and then doing the jump down squats. These eccentrics are amazing for building your buns. Aim for 20 seconds high intensity and then do the number of jump downs according to the phase that you're in. So hopefully this helped you. Let me know if you have any questions or comments about it down below and enjoy the booty games. Show the booty gains. Those booty gains. <laughs> Since it is Mother's Day, I have my mamas here. This is my grandmother, Noni. We call her the mother of my mother. We wanted to just chat with you guys a little bit about people keep saying, oh, you have amazing genes. And we had this conversation earlier and we we're like, well, <laughs> Noni was telling me this story about what happened when you were 18. So could you say it again? Sure. <laughs> When I was 18, my brother took me out in the evening after we finished dancing and we had a banana split actually, uh, three scoops of ice cream and the bananas and all the fruit and everything on top. And we're sitting there just talking and eating the banana split and he says to me, I hope that you enjoy the figure you have now at 18 because if you look at your, all your aunts and your uncles in the past, they are, were all fat, he used that word fat. <laughs> And, and I said, this could never happen to me. But I didn't say it right away because <laughs> it had to soak in. And, and you said, well, my favorite line, over my dead body. <laughs> I said, over my dead body. And I Don't pushed my laugh. banana split to yeah. him. Yeah. Or him. I said, you might be that, but uh, <laughs> never for me. Yeah. And, then I, and then I paused a little bit. And he, we laughed. It was, he made a joke out of it. But that stayed with me forever because I recall, remember that. It's important to what I put in my body, how I digest it, how I exercise and how I live, 
you know, so now that I'm going to be 83 soon, I think that maybe over the years that little bit of history helped me. Yeah, so it just started the conversation between all of us how we feel. Like, although we do have great genetics, like we can't argue that, we feel like we have good genes, yes. But when it comes to fitness and, you know, results and everything, your lifestyle and your choices and your, your mindset have so much to do with it. So you agree with that too. Yeah. It's like people look at us and they go, oh, you get it from your mama. But it's like, yeah, we well, get some of it from our mama, but we also choose. It's not, and it's not genetics. Uh, well, sometimes it is, but it's it's the way we saw you be. Yes. So, so it's, it's a mixture know. of nurture versus na nurture and nature. But she didn't have the role modeling role from model. her yeah. grandma no. and her mom, right. like I did. Yeah. But um, I didn't. You didn't have role modeling from me on weightlifting. I learned that from, from you. Me. Yeah. So it doesn't necessarily need to go in order. It doesn't always go down. No, it, it sometimes need... goes up and sideways and all yeah. different ways. So it's just about the motivation. We just wanted to share that little tidbit with you guys in case you know that you find this helpful to know that at every age and every stage of life you can stay fit, but you have to have the right mindset and the, the motivation, right? It's always a choice. Yeah. You have the choice to make. Yes. You decide what you want to become. So, thank you guys for being here at Sherry Yes. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to everyone. <laughs> So guys, don't forget, we have a contest running right now. If you guys are one of the first people to comment down below in the first 60 minutes of this video uploading, then you guys are in the chance to win a prize. What should we give away? What prize? Ooh, I think we should give away Build It By Extreme. Ooh, Build It By Extreme. Taught you how to do the SPC. Yeah. Great call. So comment below. We got to be within the first 60 minutes of this video uploading. And uh, if you're wondering what you should comment, put in a clip down there. So say from timestamp 1 minute 37 to time 202. I, that really resonated with me. Those are the kind of things that let us know what really resonates with you in this video. Whatever so, your favorite part yeah, was. Exactly. Timestamp it down below. And one last thing, the win Winner also of the subscriber contest because we're giving away prizes to people who just subscribe to this channel is this person right here if that's your YouTube username comment below you must be watching to win so comment down below so we can confirm that this is your username and we will send you a uh, build about extreme as well so two winners every video it's only on the vlogs though so it's not on the Ask Living TV shows, yeah. it's only on the Monday vlogs. All right, thank you so much for watching today's video. As always, if you enjoyed this, if you got any helpful hints, tips, or tricks that you're gonna take action on, then slap a like on the video, leave a comment down below. Let us know what was your favorite part by leaving the number of the timestamp in the video. Like if your favorite part was at minute five to six, something like that, leave it down below. We always are curious to hear what's your favorite part of the videos that we make. So I'll see you guys at the next video. Thanks for watching. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel, notifications on, and help us grow our mission to help everybody in the world live lean. And keep living lean. Bruno says, keep living lean. You're such a good boy. I love you so much.